Uh, sir? Sir Ricardo just wants to talk to Clarice. All right. What is it? What's wrong? Patrick, no, stop, don't. Whatever it is I had done to you, I'm sincerely sorry. Please forgive me. Don't hurt me, please. I'm no, not don't. as bad as you think I am. What are you doing? Sir Cardo told me to get you. He wants to talk to you. Will you be setting me free? Hurry up. to Grandpa Delphine. He's very ill. Clarice, let's go. I called for you because I want to tell you something. What is it, Gardo? I hope you'll forgive us for what we've done to you. All the suffering we made you endure. I know that right now you should be with your family instead, with all the freedom to do anything you want. Unfortunately, you're stuck here with us, in hiding, and your life being in danger. I never intended to do this to you, but I was forced by circumstances and got you involved. So I would like to apologize to you. And I'm promising you that it won't take long. I'll soon return you to your family. Ricardo, I understand all of that, and I hope you can forgive me too, for all the things that I've done wrong, for my misbehavior, and all the difficulties I've put you through. I know it was wrong for me to think only of myself and completely disregard the others, the consequence of insisting on doing things that were contrary to what you wanted me to do. But this time, I'm promising you, Gardo. If given another chance, I'll never destroy the trust you'll give me. I promise you that I'll change my ways, if that is what will make things right. I'm willing to trust you again, Clarice. I just hope you don't break it. Thank you so much, Gardo for understanding me all the time. I'm so grateful. I won't break my promise, that I assure you. <laughs> <laughs> 